Surgeons at a Melbourne hospital have become the first in Australia to perform open heart surgery in a portable theatre. Mark Santo Martino tells us the temporary suite may soon travel the country to keep down patient waiting times. Watching doctors stitch up a patient after bypass surgery, you'd never guess an operating theatre fit for an open heart procedure could be sitting in the middle of the Alfred Hospital's car park. On the outside it looks really not out of place in a car park, it looks like a large, very large caravan. But inside the, the space is quite deceptive. Imported from the UK after storm damage compromised one of the hospital's main operating theatres, the portable suite is directly connected to the Alfred's emergency department. And the bottom line is if we didn't have have this operating theatre running, that they might miss out on their surgery or have to wait days or weeks longer. At roughly the size of a shipping container, it's the first of its kind to be used in Australia. After rigorous safety checks, surgeons started slowly but are now routinely performing open heart procedures on a daily basis. We wanted to run simulation sessions to triple check that everything was OK. And, you know, we set a high bar, but in fact it was all, all quite fine. It's the first time open heart surgery has been done in this type of portable operating theatre in the world. Once the roof is fixed and the Alfred Hospital no longer needs an extra operating suite, this portable theatre will be offered to other hospitals around Australia who may be struggling to meet patient demand. It's a quick solution. It, I mean, building a new hospital takes literally five or more years. These things were originally built for, you know, uh, war zones and uh, military hospitals and so on. So if somebody else can utilise it within Australia, you know, that's the best really deal. Mark Santo Martino, Nine News.